previously on Apprentice A. The house is even more of a disaster than it was. Don't say whoa. What do you mean whoa? Is this a Pac-Man band-aid? Yeah. Like a storm door. Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. I just came in at your food because I missed you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Fingers crossed. Today is the day that we finally do something about this mess. <laughs> We've been so busy, like, catching up with work because we couldn't do anything for a couple days and like just continuing with work and editing videos and doing stuff uh, that all this stuff just kind of hung out and stayed here but hopefully we can do something about it today. I just have a couple videos to finish editing uh, and then we have Credo has like one phone call or something so and then we can tackle this space so I think we're gonna do the bedroom first um, because we can get everything out of the way and put our clothes away and like wear something other than the same hoodie and pants for days in a row. Uh, and then we're gonna, then we'll tackle this space. So, fingers crossed we'll get somewhere. Uh, for now, I'm gonna have some breakfast. And, um, I have this adorable thing. I'm really excited about it. Look at him! He's so cute! It's a sloth tea thing. So you put the loose leaf tea in his body, in his butt, and then he hangs out on your cup. I'm very excited. And we got a kettle now so I can have tea without boiling, uh, boiling a pot of water. Of course I'm using the wrong hand so I can't get it off the thing. There we go. This is gonna be so great. And now he just kind of chills. Corrado, come look. Come look at this thing that I made over myself. I'm in my underwear. We'll put on some pants. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. It's beautiful and I didn't even need your help. Don't tell me I did it wrong though. Oh, um, no. It's all right. Yay. Good job. Thank you. Except uh, you, this Shh. is a little bit too big and uh, it's going outside of the blob. Okay. Welcome to a nice sunny day. Uh, it's so sight, so sunny. I should actually turn on the ND filter. There we go. That's much better. So today is the day where we get to finally unpack most of our stuff. Finally, Sassy's so got a couple videos she has to edit. Uh, she's got to touch up the play the future video, and she's got to finish up vlog, and then we're good to go. I've already started uh, taking all the plastic bags off of the clothes in the bedroom for like the hangers, uh, and now I'm gonna grab myself a coffee. I also really enjoy the setup. I like how clean everything is with like a, lots of counter space without things cluttering everything. I think it's I think it's very nice. It's actually kind of getting used to it black. It's pretty good. Maybe I just got really good coffee beans, but I'm liking it now it's time to get to work. No, it's great. Chicken and just flavored breadcrumbs. Yes. Carla was saying it's basically shake and bake without the shake and bake actor, but it was literally a, we have nothing, how can we make this chicken not just plain old chicken? Italian flavored breadcrumbs. And or it actually tastes really good. It was really good. Or you just use breadcrumbs and add your own spices to it. We, we don't have any spices right now other than rosemary. But, we have but that would have worked too. Breadcrumbs. Yeah. So. It was very good. So we're clipping along here as I like dodge boxes left, right, and center. We got all the clothes put away, all my sweaters. So many sweaters, like four, four layers of sweaters. And then we managed to like utilize these drawers. So it's like pants, can't really see it's dark, but pants and socks. <sighs> so now one of the last things to do is to get the content of these boxes on the shelf. So for example, we have all the hard drives gotta go on the shelf, or the books, uh, or that kind of stuff. But yeah, one thing at a time. What is this? this of course they're closed right now. This is what I was gonna need the house. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's my favorite place, people. That's exciting. Pretty awesome. So shopping is weird because you have to like, shop for just the two of us yeah. as opposed to shop for like seven people all the time yeah so it's like what are we going to be able to eat in like a short
short period of time so it doesn't go bad. But also, we're just like paper towels. Yeah. It's like two for four dollars. But we don't need two or two packages. We just need one package. Yeah. Yep. Things like that. It's weird. Think of which one you were going to save when you're not buying groceries for five. Right? It's crazy. We finally like left the house not to get into the parking garage and then get into a vehicle, but like to actually like go places and walk around. It was pretty great. So, should do that more often. Tomorrow, I'm going to go take the car. <laughs> You're going to go to the parking garage. Go to the, the parking garage. <laughs> I have to go to Niagara because I have to go to the friggin' orthodontist. Um, I have braces and I have a splint, which is basically just a piece of metal that they glue onto your, or cement onto your, onto the back of your front teeth so it like keeps them in line after the braces come off. And this stupid thing came, one of the ends popped loose. So I have to go get it fixed. So that sucks. But, you know, needs to happen because otherwise it's just going to bug me forever. Uh, so I'm going to go to bed because I have to get up early to go to Niagara. <laughs> Uh, and then uh, we'll see you tomorrow. You should just get an orthodontist that's not on the other side of... Yeah, the but like getting a new orthodontist to go to them once every six months... I guess. Seems a little silly. I suppose. Because then you have to like pay for like, oh, we need to get all of your information and we have to do x-rays and blah blah blah. Right, As opposed to me just going and going, you already know who I am, and you know what my teeth look like. <laughs> just fix it. That's fair. So, I'm gonna go to bed. Good night. Home is where the fog is.